Hey, what's up guys? Thank you so much for checking out this video. My name is Bryce. My website is homemarketingsuperstar.com. You can get this, this Facebook groups posting software on my website. It's under the resources tab. Please check it out if you want to get it. So what this video is, guys, is I'm going to do an updated version, uh, an updated video of the Facebook groups poster. Uh, the creator, Sean Walters, this is an awesome, awesome Facebook groups poster, guys. Uh, this is the best one on the market. I, I, I sell a lot of these. A lot of people, I've never had a problem. I never had a complaint with anybody. Um, I've had this software for probably about, um, going on six months, and I, I've never once had a problem with this Facebook groups poster. So, if you're looking for a, a good software to post to Facebook groups, this is the one, okay? Uh, a lot of you may have seen uh, my video on the, this face, this specific Facebook groups poster before. What this video is going to be is it's going to be an updated version of the same Facebook poster. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's get into it. Um, like I said, the the creator Sean Walters, he actually it's this is the same Facebook group poster that I used uh, that I did before the the videos. All this video is, is he updated it, so I'm just going to show you guys the updated version, and I'm going to show you exactly how to use it. I've been needing to do this for a while. He updated it about going on two months ago, and uh, I've been wanting to do this, but I keep forgetting to do it. So I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to do it. But anyways, guys, whenever you buy this software, all you got to do, uh, whenever you buy it, you're going to be emailed your receipt. Inside of your receipt, you should have a download link. Um, through Pastebree, you should have a download link for this Facebook groups poster. You go ahead and you download it, and then you're gonna also going to be emailed in the receipt. It should be in the receipt. You're going to be emailed a key, a license key to be to put into this Facebook groups poster. So make sure that you guys put that in. Okay, once make sure that your net your net framework is up to date as well. It has to be, I believe, it has to be net dot net framework four. Okay, um, this will work on Mac as well. Uh, you have to run parallels with it. But anyways, guys, once you get this Facebook group poster, so, uh, once you get it set up, sorry, I'm trying, I'm trying to talk too fast here. Um, this takes a little bit to get going. I want to try to squeeze this all in in my time. I got a 15 minute time frame, so. Um, but once you get it going, okay, it's gonna pop up like this. And you're going to have, a lot of you guys are going to recognize that there's a lot of newer tabs. If you've bought this software off me previously uh, and you're watching this video, if you want to share this video with somebody that bought this poster off of you, that's great. What you're going to notice is there's a lot more tabs now. Um, he, he significantly redid this. He added a lot more options. Um, basically, all I'm going to go through right now is I'm going to show you guys how to join groups. I'm going to show you guys how to gather groups, your groups off of your off of your profile, and then I'm just going to show you how to post to groups, okay? Because that's all. I, honestly, that's all I use this for. I don't. I don't use this. If I want to remove groups, I'll actually go into my list and do it for me. So um, I'm not even sure what post bump is. Uh, you can disable your notifications while you're posting. That way, uh, your chat your chat boxes don't pop up and. Um, while you're posting, but anyways, guys, what you're gonna do whenever this pops up, okay? This is the same exact as the other poster. We're gonna put in our username, we're gonna put in our email address, and we're gonna do our password. So to get your username, all you do is you're gonna log into Facebook, and then once it's loaded, you want to click up here where it says your name, that, and go to your profile, and this right here at the end right up to the uh, the backslash you're gonna copy that because that's your username and then you just go to the software and you're gonna put it right in here now I already have mine saved so I'm not gonna do that but that's right there is where you wanna put it in just like that okay I'm gonna delete that and then you put the email address that you use to sign into Facebook and you use the Facebook password as well and then what you want to do guys after you put those three things in you're going to go over here and you just want to name it uh, whatever profile that you're using you know some some of us have two or three profiles so this one is my Bryce Thomas profile so I'd, I would just call it Bryce Bryce Thomas and I would save it and then you would just go down here and click save 
That way, the reason that you do that is all you got next time that you open this groups poster, all you have to do is click load like that, and you see it pops up all of your information. So then, once you do that, you don't got to click anything else. Once you have all this info, uh, if you want to join some groups, all you got to do is click join groups. And this gives you a couple options to join groups, okay? You can have an option. These options over here are for each for each setting. But um, the first way that you can join groups is you can actually go for a username from another, another profile. Okay, so how you do that is just the exact same thing that, that, you, uh, that you did to get your username. So let's minimize this. We'll bring up Facebook. Maybe. Okay, there we go. And then let's say that, uh, let's just go to my friends real quick and, and uh, we'll just randomly pick somebody. Let's just say I wanted to take this one. Okay, that's not a good one. See how this has all that extra stuff on there? You can't get that. So we'll just go back. We'll try this one. Okay. Obviously, it's not going to let us. There you go. So what you want to do to get their username right here? All you you don't you don't need all this stuff right here. Okay. There's going to be a question mark. Everything after that question mark, right here, is going to be that username. So his username is Desertio Mike. So that would be his username. So you would just copy that and go down to your your groups poster and you're going to place it right in there. And then it's going to ask you right here how many number of Facebook, uh, how many groups that you want to join from this user. Okay, so it's set up in 16s. If you want to join 800, 800 groups, you would just simply go down to 800. Uh, I don't recommend you join that many at once. Uh, just to, you know, Facebook's getting really strict on the, the Facebook jail and um, group posting. So I recommend that you do just a couple at a time. But, you know, if you have to do 800, that's fine. But uh, after you do that, you can also join by, uh, by keyword. So this is much like the BMID software. So if you wanted to join groups, if you're selling a supplement, okay, if you were selling a supplement, all you would do is you would go to you would go over here and you would type supplements um, bodybuilder and you, you separate the keywords with a comma so it would be supplements comma let's do bodybuilding comma and then that's we'll just do that and then all you would do guys is you would just click you would go over here and you would uh, select the option that you want to use. So if you're if you're using the keywords, you would get down here and join open groups by search term. And then I recommend that you join one a group every either every two to five minutes or every five to ten minutes. I do every five to ten minutes because Facebook jail is horrible. Uh, that that two weeks without posting the groups is is horrible, but. I, I just like posting the groups, but um, join groups, and then you can join groups that have more than a certain amount of people. I usually do 50. Uh, you know, less people that have lesser groups isn't necessarily a bad thing. Um, more people are going to be able to see your ad that way. So uh, I do I do over 50. You guys do whatever you want, or you can actually uh, another way that you can do this is you can actually join groups from a list so if you have a list if you're in build my income daily if you have a list of of groups that you want to like if you have one of those lists a lot of people buy lists on Fiverr or whatever for um, 5,000 groups that's fine you can uh, upload it right into there just make sure that it's a text file that you open it with notepad and not wordpad okay and then we're gonna go over here and post to groups I'm actually gonna post to groups so all you do to post to groups, okay, you see there's a lot more options added. He added a lot more. So we're going to go over here, and I want to post 300 today. So you can just go down to 300. And then number of posts to make before taking a break, we're going to do, we'll do 30. 
time to wait in between posts, I usually do five to ten minutes. Okay, because if you do any less than that, you can do less than that, but I, I don't recommend it, guys. You're 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 really risking your your account being placed in Facebook jail. And um, this Facebook group poster is a very good software if you run it correctly. Okay, and then we're gonna take a break after. We're gonna take a break for 35 minutes after 30 posts. So right over here where it says your ad copy, I recommend that you you pre-write your ad out on a text file which I have done and I'm going to go ahead and pull oops I'm going to go ahead and pull my ad up from out of here documents damn and I'm not finding the ad that I want Sorry guys, my computer's being really slow. Okay, whatever, I can't find it. So, uh, I'm just going to pick an ad right now. Actually, here's the one that I wanted. <laughs> As you can see, I already wrote mine out. It has, it's already spun. Um, if you don't know how to watch the other, uh, I'm not going to get into spinning the ad because I only have 15 minutes total, so... If you need help spinning the ad, uh, this software actually comes with, or you can message me on Facebook or whatever, but um, I have lots of tutorial videos on how to spin ads for these. And then you just want to scroll up and through here, make sure there's no huge spaces in between, which there isn't. It looks good. And then I go over here, posting options. You can post text only, no URL or no photo. I'm going to do post a photo only with no URL. And then I'm going to do a single photo, and you go over here and you upload your photo. So we'll go to pictures. Let's do. Yeah, we'll do that one. And you can load a, a list here. You have to load a list, actually. Um, I'm going to go ahead and load my list. But. You just gather your groups uh, to, to get your list. You just go over to gather your groups. If I have time, I'll show you how to do that real quick. Where am I at here? Okay. Real quick, if you want to gather your groups, right here, you just click on this tab, and then it's going to ask you select a group type below. You, uh, if you want to gather all your groups or just open groups, that's fine. And then you just select the number of groups that you want to gather from your from your profile, and you you make you click here where it says choose file, and you make a text file to save it to. Make sure it's Notepad text file to save it to. That's all you guys got to do. Which I'm not going to do that right now. I'm going to go back over here, and I'm ready to start posting. So we're just going to click start just let it do its thing let it post an ad here so you guys can see it go guys this Facebook groups poster is awesome I've never like I said in the beginning of this video I've never once had a problem with this this software he updates it all the time if something changes on Facebook uh, he's honestly he's right on top of it I, I've never had to wait more than I don't even think I've ever had to, I've never opened this Facebook groups poster and had to worry about, uh, you know, it not working or anything. I've never had to, to, to deal with that, so. Alright, so, I'm getting up on the, the time limit here, but. As you guys can see, it loads your group. It, it works. It, it works the exact same way as the other one did. Okay, I'm gonna cut this this video off. But uh, 
Thank you guys so much for watching this. If you want this software, there's a link below and also on my, my site, www.homemarketingsuperstar.com. Thanks, guys.